to Burton Albion. How happy, first question, how happy are you to have signed a, a two year deal at the Pirelli Stadium? Yeah, buzzing. Uh, really happy to be here. Uh, I was keen to get it over the line pretty soon, as was Burton and the gaffer after I spoke to them. Uh, you know, they showed their interest pretty early uh, and I was, I was flattered by it and I was, you know, for me I just want to concentrate on football now so the earliest I got it done really for me and my family the better. Well, is that always the case when you're a player going out of contract, you want to always get, I suppose, get your future sorted as, as quickly as possible? A little bit, yeah. Uh, there's been times where, you know, it's better to hold out or everything but for me it was a bit of a no-brainer, uh, you know, I don't live too far away, uh, kids growing up and keep them in the same schools so that all factors in as you as you get to the age I am now 29 uh, so and when you when I thought about all that and the, and the situation and the, the two-year deal and playing for the, for the gaffer uh, it was a no-brainer. Well, so you say you've spoken to the gaffer what, what's he said to you how he sees you fitting into the squad and, and yeah how excited are you to be as a striker playing under Jim Floyd Hasselbank? Well, that was a massive one for myself because obviously I remember him playing and I remember how you know how good he was as a, as a striker and basically I, I said to him I want to learn off him and you know I want to pick up pointers from him and you know and just keep on learning uh, and that's why I was interested to come here uh, I know the club uh, you know I'm, I'm a Stoke lad so I'm not too far away so I've always kept an eye on Burton as, as a football club and I know some of the lads as well you know John Brayford uh, you know, grew up not far from from where he's from so kind of <clears throat> seen him about and stayed in contact a little bit so that was good uh, but yeah uh, really excited to work with the gaffer and, and learn uh, and learn different things off him. Did you speak to Bray about, um, about joining the club? I haven't actually no yeah. I've not had, uh, not had a chance to speak to him it's happened pretty fast actually uh, but yeah I'm sure we'll have a little catch up and uh, we'll have a chat. Um, for you personally obviously last season a bit of a frustrating one but <coughs> how are you set for pre-season and, and how much are you looking forward to the future now, I guess? Yeah, it's been a, a frustrating uh, couple of seasons, really. Uh, but, you know, that's all behind me now. I'm, I'm, I'm fit, I'm fresh. You know, I've had a bit of time off. Uh, so for me, as an as a, as a individual and as a player, I'm just really focused on uh, playing games and enjoying it again. Uh, and, that, and that was the, a big factor in me coming here. Uh, the gaffer expressed that to me. Uh, and that's, that's a big thing for me and my family, you know, to go in and enjoy my football uh, and get to the, the minutes I feel like I deserve. Absolutely, and in terms of any Brewers fans who, who may not have seen you play, how would you sort of describe yourself as a striker? Uh, I think first and foremost I'm a goal scorer. I think my record uh, speaks for itself on that term. Uh, I think wherever I've been really I've scored goals. So that's where, you know, what's, that's what I'm paid to do basically. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm a grafter. Like I say, I come from Stoke where, you know, I uh, come from a working family. Uh, so quite grounded and you know I work hard uh, and I'll, I'll work hard for the team and the football club uh, and that's what you'll get with me uh, it's what you see is what you get I'll, I'll put 100%, 100% in every game and uh, that'll get my goals basically and what's the plan for you now as we sit here we're about three weeks from pre-season is this the awkward bit for a footballer just waiting around to, to get involved with your new club yeah uh, don't get me wrong I'm going to enjoy the time off yeah. <laughs> <laughs> with the family of that but uh but yeah, I think because this is all different and all new for me, I'm very excited and I want it to happen here and now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so yeah, I'm chomping at the bit basically. Uh, but I'll enjoy, you know, a, a week away with the family and then, you know, I'll concentrate on getting back and meeting all the lads and all the staff here. And uh, I'm sure everyone will make me feel really welcome. Well, Louis, welcome to Burton Albion. Thank you very much.